I plan on finishing the day, but we did lose 2013 frames last time. So if you pop on over to the um if you're watching that last video and you notice it's all like uh, e uh I blame that on my computer. It does that sometimes. I don't know why. I've got a good computer. Uh it's fairly decent. Uh, it's just an Inspiron laptop. I use a laptop to record. Uh, uh, the reason is because uh, the thing about desktops is I bought this laptop when I first started because I started on the second floor of my house and the thing about the second floor was we kept our desktop in the basement and I couldn't quite use the desktop because there's no cable long enough like I can't there's no USB extension cords that I know of um I mean there might be so if anyone finds a USB extension cord and would like to tell me where to buy one uh, that'd be that'd be weird because I don't think there's such a thing but plus the desktop is old and I mean old our desktop still runs on XP this is the only computer that we have that even runs on Windows 7 the other computer we have just runs on Vista <laughs> church events fall schedule Sunday school Sundays Bible study Mondays and Bright Falls Knitting Club meetings, Alt Wednesday evenings, Deerfest Candle Night September 14th, Deerfest Morning Service September 15th, the Presbyterian Choir of Watery Visit September 28th, Annual Charity Bake Sale October 3rd. This is a Presbyterian church. Oh, it looks so odd. Is it something noticeable about Alan Wake's? Alan Wake is that the church actually has a religious symbol on top, which is something that they did a good job of taking out of a lot of games. Uh, like, through most of any time games have existed, religious symbols have like kind of been like, a, eh, <laughs> we don't want to put them in there because we don't know if it might offend people or not. I don't know if that's done as much today as it was back in the 80s. I know for a fact that they co would cover up a crap ton of stuff in uh, games that were imported from Japan. No guns in the church. Let's bring guns to the church. Now this is a place where I could go for using... <laughs> Anytime it just says survive, I know I could go for using a, uh... She just shot at me. I think tonight, uh, go watch some Doctor Who or something. Maybe Firefly. It's been a while since I watched Firefly. Uh, Stargate. Just Saturday and Saturday I'm going to watch night too. Camera got all spinny again. But... That's why I hate flashbangs. They're so slow to actually use because it's just like you gotta wait for them to blow up. Flashbangs, if you ask me, are one of the worst tools to use for this game. Like, they're cool because they just kill everything. 
but the fact that they take so long to become effective as a weapon is what really kills them in my mind. But 2,000 frames, god. That's most likely the whole episode. Oh god, I've just, I've just realized, I've got to save before this moment. Uh, this is that moment, save. So probably all of the part where, you, where I got the keys, and then got to the bookstore is probably gone. I will do my best to get that that piece of video back. <sighs> I'm dead again. The game is giving me a brutal migraine. Because of just how many times I'm dying. But the fact that I lost two thousand frames is probably ensured that there won't be that there's gonna be a missing episode. And in the event that an episode is missing, it's bad because I like to be pretty good with uh, keeping everything consistent. Uh, oh yeah, I gotta read the sign again. Those weren't all like small fry enemies. I would have lined them. I would just been able to chuck a flashbang down there and killed the entire group. Alright, I gotta find. Alright, those two are both moving really fast. Those three, actually. So I just wanna kinda nuke them with a flashbang. what we're gonna do now is target one and just launch it and just use the flare gun or we could use a flare gun on those on those two guys but we want to get rid of these fast moving guys And that's that. Okay, it's open. Let's go, Wake. Okay, it's open. Gosh, give me a break. Wow. We keep them lit all night long on the night before Deer Fest. Why? Well, it's Oh yeah, this is the candlelight Deerfest 
night candles. That's just a manuscript page that we've gotten that I've got before, but there's one right there. Uh, can you read that? That looks like something you might want to read. But it's not. Come back here. This is like this is a cloister. Yeah, there's no way going through the crypt will turn out to be a bad idea. Uh, it, it's actually not bad. It sounds like it'd be creepy, but it's not. The, the crypt isn't bad. I mean, it's not like they just decide to throw, like, Zombie Taken in it. Not that Zombie Taken wouldn't be cool. Uh. That's, like, almost all the enemies that are in the crypt are just dead right now. That's a cremation device? I kind of don't want to know what that is. There's the exit, but but I don't want to go down it because there might be collectibles, collectible bobs in the back here, like a coffee thermos. Can't leave without getting one of those. Oh, and that's all for today. See you guys then.